Chad from Alltel Diagnostics and welcome to the shop. On today's episode, we're going to talk about adding ADOS to your current Maxisys tablet. I will be adding the ADOS upgrade to my MS909 and using this as my ADOS tablet. What does it mean to have ADOS added to your Maxisys tablet? The ADOS upgrade will give you the ability to do ADOS calibrations for both dynamic and static calibrations. If you are only doing domestic cars and you only need to do dynamic calibrations, this will give you a step-by-step -step guided function without having to have any target sets. The scan tool will walk you through the process and walk you through the calibration steps. And once the calibration is done, the scan tool will notify you and you can use that on your pre-scan and post-scan reports. You will want to make sure if you are going to choose the complete solution or the MA600 solution before you do this process. The reason I say that is once you have chosen your calibration stand, that is permanent in the scan tool and cannot be changed. Let's get started with the process. The first step is to purchase your ADOS upgrade, and that can come to you in two forms. That can come to you in a digital form, like I have here, which is printed out, or it will come to you in a physical card. Either way, we're going to use those numbers on that card to add it to your scan tool. The process is simple. We're going to select the ADOS icon, and you'll have information about the ADOS system and the different options that Autel offers. We're going to select ADOS registration. It's telling us that our device is not bound to a target stand yet. Again, we want to make sure that we know what solution we are going to go with if we are in the future to make sure we choose the right one. So plan ahead. We're going to select OK and select Confirm. We are going to use the ADOS Complete solution on this tablet, so I'm going to select ADOS Complete. Now, it's telling us and warning us that once you choose this, you can't go back. So make sure you know what direction you're going. We're going to go ahead and confirm. And it wants us to enter the card number. So use your card that you receive or the digital version and type in the numbers in confirmation. Once that is entered, go ahead and select register. Your device has now been bound to an ADOS frame and we are on the ADOS complete solution. So our next step, now that that has been added to the tool, is to do all the updates to be able to get all that ADOS software. And that's a simple process as well. We're going to go back to the main screen and we're going to go to the update screen. Update license is complete. Tap OK to launch the MaxiSys application. It is going to basically reboot MaxiSys application so we can do all the updates we need to. You'll notice that our diagnostic image has changed and shows ADOS in the car. So now we have both diagnostics and ADOS software under that diagnostics icon. You'll also notice that our ADOS icon on the front page has gone away. So we're going to go ahead and select update. And you can see now that I have 23 updates as opposed to the one that I had previously. I'm going to go through and get all these updates completed and start working on the car. Thanks for joining me. I'm Chad from Alltel Diagnostics. If you have any questions, reach out to our tech support team. They'd be more than happy to help. Or you can reach us at autel.com or maxisysados.com.